it's just that you know especially outside of asia a lot of people don't even know what open well, I mean, is but it, i mean even today someone was asking when are you going to the u.s and they're all like it's hard <laughs> it's, yeah that's true it's obvious that this is a very exciting new form of tech it's a way of mitigating a couple of problems we've had with phones up until now the notch are we talking about the notch because Pretty that is much. the one big glaring, glaring problem that so I that know so that was my question like did you particularly hate notches mm-hmm. and then you can compare also to pop-ups like to see how pop-ups i are. have literally turned off notches on phones where i can turn them off i would rather live with a bezel than with a notch <laughs> and this is also why i specifically love pop-up selfie phones yes so now what we have is not a little shark fin not a little Mm pop-up i still think the find x pop-up was like people's favorite yeah Yeah, that was that was awesome in 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 any case like what Oppo was trying to do is just eliminate all of that altogether Mm -hmm. so there's a tiny little area at the top it's a little like square around it's almost like a notch that is almost invisible though it is, though like, I will say in my camera, I was able to figure out where it was. And I, I was too, but it's like, it entails a lot of maneuvering. Mm-hmm. It's something that you see because we know about it. Yeah, but so you're like some, looking yeah, for it. To someone who just saw the phone, they're going to use it and they're going to even forget that that's where the camera's at. Sure. And, you know, to the normal user, they're not going to think about it, but it's a, such a tiny thing that makes everything like, all the more seamless yeah and i wish there was a little bit more info as to exactly how that was achieved but from the articles that i was Mm -hmm. reading when it was announced at mwc shanghai it's basically there's a tiny area at the top that was made as transparent as Mm -hmm. possible without losing a layer that allows for the screen to render still yeah so in most cases mm -hmm. it's still going to show the screen yeah and then contextually that tiny little part which is probably the best way for me to put it is it might be a tiny little secondary display Mm -hmm. gets deactivated accordingly yeah and i remember if i'm not mistaken that i read an article once before uh and when asked about like the quality they sort of like shrugged it off saying of course if there's going to be a screen tiny little layer the quality would not be as um would not be at par as a camera that didn't have that tiny layer, right? Yeah, does that does that worry you? Not really, because you have to remember we live at a time when it's only okay, let me rephrase. It's only now that people are starting to prioritize selfie cameras. Like up until like last year, we've had like cameras with crappy front face like phones with crappy front facing cameras, right? We tried it out, it didn't look that bad. So it's like and at the end of the day what this is really is a proof of concept right so this doesn't mean that this is the final and i think to your question i think that's why they didn't they haven't put out that much information it's because it's a proof of concept like oppo likes doing this remember the zoom at mwc years back and when did we actually see the zoom right Mm -hmm. so it's a proof of concept they're saying we can do it and i think that ties into all the things that we've heard oppo talk about today they talk about their innovation they talk about their technology they talk about being more than a smartphone maker and well this is basically telling the world that look we can innovate it's not necessarily something we're putting out right now and even at the keynote they mentioned that they don't necessarily want to be first but this is sort of like a brand a brand's bragging rights a little you know? bit, yeah. And that was literally, they stole the show in uh-huh. MWC Shanghai. They did, they did. Yeah. If the camera software is able to do some algorithmic processing, perhaps do, do like an automatic dehaze mm-hmm. or something like that, that it might not matter <coughs> so much that the quality is going to be a bit under because it's literally under a layer, yeah. a semi-transparent layer. So I guess first off, the quality isn't that bad anyway at this point. Because also, if you think about it, what do we use selfie cameras for? Just these aren't cameras that go on like, these aren't photos that go on like albums. These are like Instagram story. Like yeah. th- That's what this camera is for. You <laughs> Not know? everyone's like me vlogging with it. Yeah, exactly. You're like <laughs> a very rare breed. But yeah. So that's one. Two, again, we saw the quality. It's not that bad. Three, I don't doubt that software can fix this because then again, you have like Imagine Google. Pixel, yeah with like just who lived on like just which lived on just one camera for like years Mm -hmm. and still had the best photos but i guess the question now is if they can do it and what they will actually do yeah 
Like, and we haven't seen many others. I think this is like the only USC that we've seen so far. Yeah, I don't think we have seen it. Yeah, like, have so we? Oppo's Oppo's really keeping it close to the chest. They don't uh-huh. want anybody knowing what's going on. We don't even know what camera. <laughs> we don't even we know don't what even cameras know what under there. Phone. Yeah. Like the cameras are on. It was a weird prototype thing, uh-huh. and it, it was a sleek like, looking. Yeah, looking it looks thing. like a Reno. It, it without fe- the selfie and without yeah, with pop- buttons. Yeah, without buttons. Yeah. Yeah, which is weird. It just had that haptic engine. But it it it, I think this is an awesome thing. Like even more than the pop up, and people know how crazy I am about the pop up. Well, camera. I'm just happy that because. With the with the pop up camera, you eliminate the ability to put clip on lenses. Mm-hmm. Uh, you can't really put any weight be- mm-hmm. uh, load bearing things on there. So now with even with this, the USC, I can put my usual clip on on the front mm-hmm. and get that wide angle, get that zoom, mm-hmm. all of that. So I'm actually kind of excited because of that. It actually mm-hmm. alleviates that problem for me. Um, but yeah, selfie taking with mm-hmm. good selfie taking with full screen display. That's true. That's your dream right That's there. That's true. <laughs> I just. I'm excited for it. That's that's all I can say. It's like I made a beeline for it, as you know, when we yeah. decide. So lo and behold, I am excited even more. <laughs> all right. Well, well, you finished your tea, but why don't we just? Oh, do that sorry. Real quick. I really like this tea. <laughs> yeah. Well, there you go. Cheers. 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 Thank you for that, babe. Mm-hmm. 